Welcome to an epic Thursday product post. So last week, we didn't have that many products, and I promised you that this week would be epic. Well, it's going to be epic. We've got all sorts of cool stuff, so let's not wait. Let's see what we've got. We've had some small servos and some bigger servos, but we haven't had a really good in-between size until now. This one is we're calling a medium servo is just right in between the big and the small. And of course it comes with all the hardware and everything else that the other servos come with. But the interesting and exciting thing about this is that it works directly with our new robot claw arm. So this actually attaches directly onto the robot claw that we just got. And this claw is actually all metal and it's really neat. It's a parallel gripping arm, so instead of pinching, it actually closes parallel like that. So I've got a little demo, so let's take a look at that. What I've got is an Arduino running the servo knob command, which takes the input from a potentiometer and adjusts the claw opening based upon the position of the pot. So there we go. So if we grab a dice kit over here, it's pretty cool. It can grab quite a bit actually. So this claw is pretty awesome. We can see this being used in a lot of different projects and we're excited to see what people come up with this one. So this week we've got a product that really sucks. It's a vacuum. This runs off of 12 volts and you can use this for a lot of different things. It's got a lot of suction actually and we're going to do a little treat for you. We're going to show you how to make your very own coffee ground sucker up picker upper thing right here. So let's put one together. All you need is a balloon, some coffee grounds, some tubing, this is quarter inch inner diameter, some scissors, and hopefully some funnels. You don't actually need this, but it does help out quite a bit. So what we're going to do is first we're going to get the balloon ready, and we want to cut off this top rib on the top. There we go. And we're going to fill this up with coffee grounds using this bigger funnel. So we're just going to pour some in. And we want this to be about filled up to here. Now what we need to do is we need to get this through this funnel. So we need to pull this through so we can attach it. And a little trick I did was to take um, twist tie or something, even length of wire, and wrap this around and tape it and pull it through. And then you can easily pull it through. And then we're just going to fold it down and then attach our hose. And that's it. Now when you press this into things and suck air out of it, it will conform to whatever shape that you press it into and you can pick it up. Now that we've built this end of it, we just plug it into our vacuum pump. We've got that plugged into our breadboard power supply that's just giving us 12 volts from a computer power supply. We've even got a little piece of pantyhose plugged in here just as kind of a rudimentary filter to filter out some of the coffee grounds. So let's see what this looks like in action. We're just gonna mash this into whatever we're trying to pick it up. Apply suction, and there we go. And you can see it conforms to what we're trying to pick up. Now we turn it off drops out. All this is made possible with this handy little vacuum suction pump. Um, it's a really neat item. It's 12 volts. It's pretty nice and with the quarter inch inlet and outlet you can use this for all sorts of stuff in addition to the little coffee ground picker upper. So check this out for sure. So here we've got a pan tilt bracket and it consists of these two little U brackets that are drilled with all sorts of mounting holes, a servo bracket holder, and just some basic hardware. And basically you fit to get these together like this, mount in your servo, and you've got a pan tilt bracket that looks like this. We've got this one mounted to our joystick shield and an Arduino, and we've got this um, thumb joystick mounted to our two small servos. So let's see what it does. So when we move the joystick, it moves the servo bracket accordingly. So you could have a webcam mounted onto the end of this, you could have a little claw gripper, all sorts of different things. And it's really, really useful and handy. And finally, we've got...
this robot base platform. This thing is really awesome and we're very excited to be getting this. It's a really great size platform and what's neat about it, it's actually got four servo motors that are nicely terminated and you've also got the breakouts for the encoders for all four and it's got these really nice beefy tank treads. You can raise up each one of these wheel hubs just by pulling them out and putting them into a different position and it's just a really neat platform and AVC is coming up and as you could guess this could be the perfect platform for your AVC ground vehicle. So last week I promised that this one would be epic and hopefully we've delivered on that promise. We've got so much cool stuff between the vacuum pump, the pan and tilt bracket, the robot base, and of course the gripper arms. So we've even got more stuff so check out the whole product post on the website and see all the other stuff that we have for this week and we're going to see you back again next week with even more new products. So happy Thursday. See you next week.